Okay, chat. Um, I think we're good for right now. Sorry about that. So we're in the process of getting it home. So right now there's a lot of stuff. Uh, so there might be some parts during this playthrough that like are kind of abruptly pause or something. And that's why. But anyways, uh, we can go ahead and actually hit new game for now. Uh, and then kind of take it from there. So we got three types of difficulties here. Survival. Resources that you find on levels, higher difficulties, levels expanding the base, crafting items will be more difficult, combat, that they will be more effective. And then management is companions will be kept alive and more difficult. Actually, I'm going to keep it pretty easy for this part. So is there even, oh wow, there's an even lower one. There's a very easy, I'm going to do easy. I don't really care. Show always. Yeah, let's do show. Show always. Portrait will help you better differentiate between story characters and get attached to them. However, they may disturb some people who don't like user interface. That's fine. Start game. Auto save. Press any key to continue. NAR Corporation begins trials of their proprietary recultivation technology. Chromium 90 and plutonium 240. Some never abandoned their homes or even moved back. Will Samashev's be removed forcibly from the exclusions of demonstrations across the Ukraine? Ten billions of Herumnias for an indefinite lease. This is a cabal. NAR thinks they are above the law. What does NAR really hide behind the patent rights? One thing is certain the sarcophagus must remain intact. Wake up, you sleepyhead. Look, look over there. Do you remember the glade just beyond those trees? That's where you proposed to me. Tatiana. You were so nervous and sweet. You're still sweet, my Professor Kimunik. Anyway, it feels good to return after all these years, doesn't it? Decor? You're still half asleep. Wake up. Ah. Uh. Awake again. Tanya? Tanya? Hold on one second, chat. I think my mouse is going to end up going over to the other screen. Yep, it does. All right, one second. Let me close Tanya, this out. Stop kidding around. You sleepy head. Sure that sound quality is good. Good there too. Whew. Clouds over Chernobyl. What's going on, bad? How you doing, man? Why is it so? There's like major motion blur. Hold up. Let me turn that down. That is hurting my eyes already. Full screen. Did apply. Chilling, same here, man. Same here. Whoa, everything's on ultra. <laughs> Motion blur, turn that off. Le depth of field bloom, we can turn those off. They move that down just a little bit.
idea. But. Igor. Wait. Proposed to me. You were so nervous and sweet. Anya Amelieva, stop this childish nonsense at once. Where? After all these years, my professor came. I did not like that. Oh my god. That's enough. For like two seconds. What is this? Move. What now? Igor. There's green fire. How do we even get here? We walked off a train. This does not look safe. Oh God. Oh. Where? Oh, right there. No. Cherno host? What the heck? Oh. Wait, I'm double tapping it. Boy, that's weird. A little clunky for the controls, but. When you don't aim down sights, if you just right or left click, then he just, uh, like uses the, the, uh, butt of the gun. Indie game? Yeah, it is technically. Funny enough, I actually saw this game at, uh, PAX East like three years ago. I always thought it looked really cool. Why is this place so familiar? It's my old workshop. Hmm. Old workshop, you say? Well, maybe we should not craft anything because we don't have any materials. Please hurry. This reality is coming apart, can't you see? Ah, uh, yes, of course. Reality is falling apart. Why else wouldn't it be? Would it be? There's more. Okay. Uh, we almost have all the parts we need. It's a card. Get back to your work. It's the only way out of here. I'm working on it. Can't go any faster right here. Crafting station. A portal generator. Ah, of course. Yo, what's going on, St. Lurkin? How you doing? <laughs> Pretty good. How are you? Whoa. We just go forward it in time. Feels good to return. The 
The entire zone is on lockdown. Any hour doesn't screw around. Yeah. Let's just hope our source comes through and we don't run into any patrols on the way. And what if we do? We will improvise. That's what our sleeping beauty here paid us for, remember? Sure, sure. Do you really think they'll test this recruit recultivation? Re Back on the chicken and hating it right now. Signs of that, but I'm telling you, that's fun. Up. <laughs> there are way too many contractors for such a small area. We can handle the contractors. They're probably some of Wagner's rejects. Fuck you! I fought alongside those guys. That's I know. I'm just fun. messing around, Anton. I'm Let's trying to get back to it. I'm going back to the gym for the first time in a while Chernobylite? tonight. That's what it's called. I've been slacking Igor? for a bit, but there's been a lot Igor. of other stuff going on. So that's my excuse, even though I shouldn't have an excuse. Wake up, Igor. We have to go. What? I must have dozed off for a moment. Hopefully I will. <laughs> I know I'm gonna be weak, but I feel you? being I feel the weakness, but it it's it'll work out. Having doubts, Professor? If you're thinking about backing out, you need to tell us now. Not a chance. Let's get this over with. <laughs> Alright, let's do this. Are you sure this plan of yours is gonna work, Professor Kimanyuk? Igor, please. And yes, it will. You two take care of your part and I'll take care of mine. Alright? Try to keep a low profile. Last thing we want is a firefight. A, a fire? What are you getting us into, Igor? It is necessary. It's something that needs to be done. I don't like riddles, Professor. But you're the boss. Reminds me of that night up in Syria. Remember that, Olivier? I do, unfortunately. Well, this actually looks kind of cool right now. Like a black ops mission. Misha, we can't. We have to fall back. The pressure's oh, no. dropping. Downstairs. Now. Go, go, go. Oh, God. This is no time for bird watching, Igor. Let's go. Through the fence. Into the sewers. Sewers. Oh. And down into the underworld we go. It's nothing but a hole in the ground, Anton. Oh. Does anyone else feel itchy? So. How bad is the radiation around here these days? It's been a long time, right? Do yourself a favor and don't think about that right now. Let's focus on doing the job and getting oh, out nice. of here in one piece. If we sprint, they actually Igor, move faster. That's shit funny. Hits the fan, get yourself out of sight until we take care of it, okay? <laughs> don't be a Giroi. Don't panic, Olivier. No Giroi is here. No talking. Go. After you, Igor. Ladies and eggheads first. Spawn. Politely or tell them off. <laughs> Funny guy. Be nice. Oh, my name is Igor. Shit, Igor, get down. Get to the sewer entrance. We're right I thought one you. of them was. Notice uh, the compass at the top of the screen. Objectives, important characters, and random events are marked there. Use it. When you get lost or don't know where to go to next. Stay in the shadows. Yes, ma'am. I'll stay in the shadows. So I guess the explosion didn't go off yet, and it was just like in his head so far. This isn't really the shadows right now. I hope that's okay. I don't see anybody. Become oh, invisible. there's people.
Um, he is totally looking this way. Yeah, uh, kind of sketchy. Sketchy. He's investigating, I think. Oh no, no, no. <laughs> Stay right there. Alright, I guess it's nothing. Must have been the wind. <laughs> Eagle, hey, over here. Try. Try. Stand up. I can't. Oh. When I finish my contract, I'm going to grow a beard. Chicks and mom. Eagle, hey, beard. over here. <laughs> All right, I'm here. Let's go. Let's go. Hopefully they don't hear that. This is the right entrance. I used to work here, remember? Yeah. For a rock I'm at him. Sure. True. Igor, All right, let's go. Take a rad reading, will you? Uh, okay. Open inventory and use the environmental analyzer. Number one. Wait, is that? Oh, you have to throw it over here. Press F to equip it. Three point six. Not great. Not terrible. Chin up. We're safe for another hour or so. All right. None of you are safe. Uh, Captain Olivier, sir. Turn it up a little bit. You sure this device of yours works, Eagle? Oh, There's lean have mechanics time for getting into details right now, but yes, Ooh. all it needs is more Chernobylite. Loot. Chernobylite. Right. The most radioactive compound on Earth. Oh God. A man knows what he's <laughs> doing. Yo, a hateless heart. Uh, TTV we'll or hateless here. You know Thank it. you for the. Uh... Oh wait, no, it is heart. Hateless heart TV. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. I'm struggling reading that there. Yee. How you doing? Good. Same here. Same here. Chilling. Same. Oh god. The readings are bad. I hate the numbers games that are too do high. That. We have to get out of here. Sound. We can't leave him behind, dear god. Let me out of here. Alexander Boresovich, someone has to open the valves manually. Someone has to go inside. Ouch. Where'd they go? There's one of them. There's oh, the other one. Two hostiles up ahead. Quiet. Two hostiles. That one's yours. I'll take yeah. I'll take the other one, Olivier. Oh, look at Bright Boy over here. Okay, it's your show. But if you get us killed, I'm gonna be pissed. Fire bars and rising. This may surprise you, but I'm actually a soldier, not a nuclear physicist. Um, I think so. It's one sec. Got him. So this is like a Chernobyl happened, but all the events back there. of this also is in Chernobyl. So I don't think it's like an apocalypse or anything. This is just they're literally inside of Chernobyl. What was that, Eagle? 
Yeah, literally break All his right, neck. Eagle. You're the star. Ready to execute the plan. Just choked him out. I'm accessing the terminal. If the AZ5 button is still working. Then what? You go don't! Tatiana? What are you stalling for, Igor? Time is critical here. Don't press the button, but be honest. Press the button. Press the button and make an excuse. Did you hear be that? Honest. The voices? That's not the kind of question I want to hear right now, Igor. Are you okay? Don't do it, my love. Shit, 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 I can't! I can't press the button! Suit yourself, Anton. Let's move. Wait, what happens if we press it? The reactor room, now! What would happen? We listen to the voices. I don't know if that was a good idea. I don't see anything else in this room. Whoa. Anton, please, you're stressing me out. Is it? Kryptonite. Oh, it's even colder than I remember. You've seen one of these before, haven't you? A much smaller fragment, but enough for my initial studies. Are you going to tell me how this fancy gun of yours works? It creates a kind of shortcut through time and space. It's called a wormhole. It forms a tunnel with two mouths. It, it needs an exotic energy source to keep it open. Exotic energy. Uh, that's the Chernobylite? Exactly. You literally just and stuff it into the gun? Shortcut Whoa. Lead? What the? It leads wherever it needs to. Let's leave it at that for now, all right? What? My fiance. She disappeared here during the disaster 30 years ago. Yeah, can we talk about her later? Grab the crystals and let's go. What? Oh my fucking god. Help me. Go, go, go! You, why are you here? Olivier? Where the hell did you go? Olivier! Whoa. We still have the... Oh, there's the scanning thing right here. I think? No, I think it's just lit up like that. Are you all what right? What the fuck was that? Listen, I... Jesus, I'm so sorry, Olivier. Anton was... Uh, he was a good man. Who was that fucker? Hell if I know. Somehow he used the negative energy of the Chernobylite to teleport. Now, to confirm this theory... Stop. That doesn't matter right now. Can he get to us here? And where is here exactly? We're inside a wormhole connecting two singularities. It's quite short and not very stable, so we need to move. Do you understand? And no, he can't chase us in here. I, I mean, it's possible in theory, but highly unlikely. I, I don't want to know. Just I think he, out of here. he this got way. to the other guy You'll by come out using it, place, too. Hopefully. Let's meet there, then. My arm. Oh, it feels like the muscle's been twisted from the inside. I'm going to execute that black masked motherfucker, Anton. 
I promise you. <laughs> we got an achievement for Blask Black Mask Wearing Mother. And then it says This place bleep. is definitely not what it used to be. It's like a snake shedding his skin over and over again. You have to learn it all over again. Feel it. Tame it. I really thought that this game was just going to be like a survival uh, game with like some light storylines, but um, then when I actually saw it in 1.0 and watching a few people play it, turns out it's a lot more than that. Uh, the singularity tearing at the fabric of reality. The foundations of this reality are really quite fragile. You're out of time. Go. Run. I'll go flashlight. Oh God. I do not like that. <gasps> Get over here. Through these gates, more than I can count. Let's go in <laughs> together, my love. I don't like jump scares. I need to find a way to reduce my rad levels first. Oh God. Spend too much time in a containment area. Use uh, anti-rad. Okay. Like Fallout. Number three. Ah, okay. Green. Very good. Default highlight all resources and items in the area, but it can also be used to filter and search for various items. R and T to select herb herbs. Oh, that's cool. Food rations, other. You're hurt, Igor. Tend to your wounds. Collected enough. I have no med kit. Perhaps I can prepare oh, something okay, a so when you do that, it'll just like highlight that specific item I see. But when you scan, it highlights all the items. Collected enough ingredients. Now find a bonfire and create a healing salve. Like trying to figure out how to scan again. Whoops. Yo, what's going on, Wally Wall? How you doing? What up? Oh, this way. It doesn't want me to do any more searches. There's a bonfire. Sit by the bonfire. Good, good. Just deciding what game to play. Nice. What games are you thinking of playing? That's the real question. Healing Salve Craft Successfully crafted Well, let me guess We gotta actually use it Number four Cool We still got more ingredients We can grab nearby Grab that Grab that, this, that, this. Oh, now I see the scan bar. I was like looking for that. How do you figure it out? But I see it now. Okay, so like now we could scan again. Cool, cool. So that's how that works. 
was thinking about uh final fantasy or wow nice final fantasy is always fun wow is fun too sometimes but um personally i'm um, hands where i've I checked out it. what's okay. the password oliver it's me would you mind i can't think with that gun pointed at me igor damn it nostalgia it's nostalgia it was your idea god damn it come on in igor you're a bit of a handyman right take a look around and see if any of this crap is useful this Will is do. your element my sweet create order from this chaos press b to start rebuilding your base i've heard that the base building is very similar and i can already tell to fallout 4's base building which is actually pretty comforting actually i'm not a big base builder but like fallout 4's um base building like mechanics and things like that is actually pretty fun in my opinion so it's actually not bad so far like we got more stuff to break down down that that already cleaning up pretty quick all right so if that's going to be the entrance let's try to put all this stuff right by the door i guess so now build a work table this is the most basic structure that will unlock access to more advanced buildings enter display build Unlocked everything, uh, the ability to build primate. Primitive structures, do not hesitate to review them. Every day you will have the opportunity to return a base and expand it. You have only limited by the amount of resources when you're ready to exit build mode. Okay. So we built the work table. You also have laser cutting machine and Chernobylite power tools. Huh. Okay. Then you have sleeping places, power supply, air quality, and radiation. So I guess that just makes the tools for us to use for future stuff. I see Mikol's old radio is working again. Yes, Anton fixed it before we left. Should be usable. I'm sorry, Olivier, really. But we need to focus on what's ahead of us. Tell me you're not going straight back to the power plant. Because if you want to commit suicide, there are easier ways. We're outnumbered, <laughs> outgunned, out everything. My team, we what are intel, we? Back setting up, up a supplies, heist. And most of all, we need a fucking plan. He doesn't understand love cares nothing about risk. Let's look okay, with him. Olivier, let's hear your plan. I'm glad you're seeing reason. See this board behind me? We can use it to map out our plan of action. Figure out how to get inside the power plant and find whatever it is you're looking for. Or whomever. Every piece of intel, every bit of info about resources will document in right here. We'll take our next step when the time is right. For today, let's focus on getting our strength back. If we're going to use this warehouse for our base, we need to find some supplies and get organized. Somewhere to sleep would be a start. Maybe we can find some cots. Okay. Agree with him. Why were we reminding okay. him who's in charge? Let's do this right. Great. I'll do everything I can to help you figure out what happened to this. Tatiana? That was her name, right? One last thing before you go. NAR uses weapons with a biometric lock. We can't use them, so we have to defend ourselves with what we have. Use it as a last resort. I presume you know how to handle firearms? Yeah, the tutorial teach me how. And you're all set. I have faith in you, Igor. Thank you, brother. We will do this together. Ah, it's pretty cool. Assign missions, go on a heist. Literally, it is, a, it actually is a heist board. What? 
That's so cool. Start each day with planning. Choose which mission you will uh, do personally on and which you will entrust to Oliver. Choose wisely. You can only complete one mission each day. You can see everything from here. You cannot succeed alone, Whoa. but there are others who will help you. I'm not sure what to do first. Should I tell Olivier to run some errands or should I do it myself? So, okay. Here's a mission that you want you or Olivier to take on today. Selecting and pressing F or clicking the blank. So, so ammo, food drop, ammo stash, uh, medical supplies, medicine drop. Okay. I feel like we should get food because like you need to eat, right? But it also tells you the success rate, I think. Percentage by Ol Oliver's, I'm just going to say Oliver's. Oliver's name has shown in his chance for completing a mission. The rate of success will also differ from assignment to assignment. The outcome will also depend on his health and morale. Marked with icons in the corners of his portrait. Uh, his innate skills and his equipment. So, whoa, 58% for the food drop. 88, 95. Let's give him the 95%. Sign location. Status, healthy, mental state, stable. Mission undefined, relation stat, uh, that. Okay, and then we can assign one to ourselves, I guess. Cool. So let's have them do that. Days left two. We have two days for that. So if we don't do it today, we can always do it tomorrow. Right now we're good on that. So let me go for less if more people show up. No, let's actually do the food. That way we at least have that. Yar, why are you borking? Uh, press enter when you're ready to start a mission. Remember that difficulty missions will do not have to be successful. Difficult missions do not have to be successful. Both you and your companions can be injured, kidnapped, and even killed. But hunger will kill you just as quickly. Okay. All right, hold on for one second, chat. I'm going to feed my dog really quickly, and then we'll continue this. So I'll be back in like two minutes. Okay. Chat. I am back, so let's go ahead and uh, start these missions. Okay, so. Oh. Shit, I can't shoot a dog. I, I just can't. Look, it isn't easy. I get it. But these animals will die anyways. And in the meantime, they're spreading radiation everywhere. It's a mercy. I just, I can't believe this whole fucking disaster. Someone screwed up. Bad. They should have to answer for it. Let the party leaders handle all of that. We've got our own job to do. Traps, mines, and automatic firing. Guns firing at opponents. Pure fun. Crafting tools. Okay, cool. Materials up here. Like, I can't get up there, though. The heck? Here we go. Identical parts.
there's like a little whenever it finishes uh being able to do another search pick lock certain item uh try crafting it at a crafting station hmm. well now that you say that crafting tools we make one right here can we take it with us Um, yeah, we got plenty of stuff. Seems like. The only parts that we need is the electric parts. Start crafting. Gas filter. Okay. Can we scrap it? Uh, you get half the amount back. Environmental modifiers. Check the entire zone. Make sure to place them in a well-hidden, abandoned places. Destroy them every day. Crabs, okay. Revolver ammunition. Hmm. This Kozlov guy seems to be important. Perhaps I should meet with him and ask about Tatiana. What the? Where did you come from? What? Wait, have you? No way. Another respectable customer. Want to make the deal of your life? You're not afraid Was of he trading sitting here? here? Ah, I know what I'm doing, my good sir. I've been trading since the fall of the Soviet Union. And besides, no risk, no gain. Sounds like you've traveled a lot. Ah, the Grand Bazaar in Tehran, Jarmak, Europa in Warsaw. Taxim in Istanbul. Up in places, my friend. Oh, the things I've seen. I'll bet you have. I have to ask, how does desolate Pripyat compare to these colorful places? Hey, where there's demand, I provide supply. I'm the invisible hand of the free market. I've got Putin, Trump, and Gates on my speed dial. Is that right? <laughs> what about Steve Jobs? What? Yeah, him too. Of course. Anyway, money makes the world go round, but bartering is also good. You want to trade? Chat exchange for food or exchange gear for food or exchange food for gear, exchange gear for food. I'm see. looking for someone. Perhaps you've heard her name. Tatiana. Tatiana Amelieva. She used to work at the power plant. She went missing. 30 years ago. Uh, I'm sorry, my friend. It's been a while since I've seen a woman. I've been too busy. Busy? With what? With creating a new world of opportunities, my friend. I'm like Gordon Gecko, only smarter. And like Jack Ma, only more hardworking. I'm going to build my commercial empire on the ashes of Chernobyl in no time. Good luck. All right, show me what you've got, Mr. Invisible Hand. For food ration, get two mass filters for one food ration. Metal plate for one food ration. Sure, we'll take one, I guess. I think I've done enough trading for now. Good luck building your fortune. Ah, <laughs> thanks. All right, well, he seems like a nice guy, I guess. Wow. All this area can actually be explored. What? It's actually kind of cool. Let's go over here, then there, then we'll go to the food drop. That's pretty cool, though. Like, I'm, at, I'm le legitimately impressed. Mushrooms. 
What is that? It kind of reminds me of like literally Metro. Oh shoot. Oh, that's a hostile. Did not know that. Let's see. Let me loot him. Oh, nice. Get over here. I'm going to put myself into escape from Tarkov category and see if anybody notices. <laughs> nice. Is that an enemy? I don't know if he, I don't think you can get inside there. Less. Looks like there might actually be a way in. I saw something lighting up. Now I don't see it. Photos around there. There's a uh join me, Igor. I'm close. Marker up here. Do I'm gonna swap some of this stuff around. Quick menu. Yeah, let's do six for that because I feel like I should have like weapons that's fine four is fine um make this five two did we pick up his uh, I thought we picked up an AK. Map, skills, companions, crafting recipes. Whoa. That's a lot of stuff. Look at me. Look at this place. I'm looking for you. I'm waiting. Honey? Please. Hurry. I swear, if you are a witch. <laughs> sir. Oh, God. What? You'll never find her. Leave this place. Wait, can we pick up the Chernobylite out of his face? I guess not. Wait, so what do we just get? A skill? Crafting ability? It says, oh, the objective's all the way in that corner. It's like it says there's an objective over there, but I don't see it. But now I see it. I can't bear it. How many souls ended up in pits like these? Am I one of them, Igor? A skull with a bullet hole in the back of it? She's just playing a violin. Primitive armor. We're right here, so I can go grab this. It's 
stuff over by that car over there. Electronic parts. drop receive now is there like an exit use the portal generator from your inventory to go back to the refugee oh okay cool that's pretty easy then uh let me i'm actually gonna go to this thing it's only 150 meters out so not like we're going too far to it. belong here where are you come out get out here oh that went into my number one spot ah didn't mean to do that I guess I should put my gun in number one uh, let's put this in number seven. Put this in number one and put this in number two. Maybe this in number five. Is that it? I got you baited. Oh shit. I think we're good now. I mean, we could just exit right now. Or I could run all the way back to these and see what's up with them. A lockpick needed to traverse. Huh. Okay, let's exit. We can always come back. Hold right click to open the portal. Transport you back to the refugee. I think this Welcome approach back, is worth friend. it anymore. Looks like we can sneak in and out of the zone without attracting attention. So, how did it go? Are you any closer to finding your old lady? You still want to go back to the power plant? I have to go back. I have the strongest feeling she's there. Feelings? You surprise me, Professor Kimenyuk. Trusting your instincts is important. But last time we tried that, we lost Anton. We need some hard evidence before we go down that road again. <laughs> Don't worry, Olivier. I'm not crazy. I'll keep gathering evidence, and when I've got enough, we can formulate a new plan. Good. Evidence, plans, information, resources. It will all get us closer to your goal, Igor. How did you do today? I'll brief you in a minute. First, let me point out a couple of things to you. Go on. You need to understand the role you're in. You hired me and rented this warehouse. <laughs> that makes you the Yo, commander what's going on, of this base. Pretty much. It means you will be in charge of all our equipment and, most importantly, our food rations. You have to start thinking like a strategist. 
like this is a military operation. Organize the base and take care of your troops. That's number one. Go and save me, man. No fun. I know from experience. Forget to feed your troops, and the morale will drop. They might even desert you. <laughs> also, in situations where resources are scarce, there's a group psychology to consider. Playing favorites, rewarding those who slack off, and not appreciating the men who pull their weight are surefire ways of creating discord amongst the men. What men? There are only two of us. For now, but that has to change if you want your power plant operation to succeed. We need more power, more intel, more skill, and more bodies. And each of those bodies will need space, food, and resources in this base. I know you're eager to bolt out there and continue your search, but you need to be patient, plan, strategize, take it slow. You have to find time to cater to the needs of your companions and manage this warehouse. If you don't, all your plans will be for nothing. You're right. I need to be smart about all of this. Absolutely. And remember, I'm here for you. I will advise and support you every step of the way. That's what you're paying me for. So. All right. Every day, all companions will submit a report on their assigned missions. They will. You will learn if their mission was successful and what they managed to achieve. All items they acquire will be automatically assigned to your inventory when you're ready. Press F to proceed. So you received ammo and a plate, I believe. Go to food distribution. Oh God, you have to do this too. Oh man, no food. <laughs> Double food, increase companions health and morale significantly. We'll do normal food. How am I doing? I'll do normal food. Uh, companion is content with the mission succeeded. You took a toll on a bit of his health. A single food ration makes your companion feel well fed. He's not happy that there's not enough beds. Take a toll on their health and physique. Okay. Yes. They give you the option, name your group, the companions, like from Skyrim. Oh my god, this is like that bunker game, 60 seconds feeding the family. Yeah, uh, yeah, the um uh yeah, I know what you mean. Uh the one can't remember the name of it off the top of my head. Papers, please. That one. Which is also a great game. Um, but yeah, this is essentially like a Fallout slash. As a uh, military man, I'm used to sleeping rough, but is it really necessary? Think you could get us some more beds? Fallout slash Metro type game. More beds. I'm on it. Yes, restful sleep is critical to our effectiveness. All right, let's make some beds. Base upgrades. It's a sleeping place. Where should we make them though? It's a real question. Build one. Oh my god, there's multiple beds that you can make. <laughs> Infirmary bed. Oh, uh, the beds actually get better. Interesting. All out shelter 3D, pretty much. Make another one right there. Basic generator. Building tools. Comfort of life in the base. Oh, so it goes down. Hey, don't come in here and bark, Yara. Well done. Now everyone will wake up well rested and ready to take on the zone. Yeah, exactly. You were doing a good job. Just saying. I know that guy is being edgy, but why waste is it? Oh, well, pretty much everywhere has a small amount of contamination. So, almost like 95% of the people are gonna be, we even me in general are gonna have mass. 
because it's still like even right here is a 1.9 which isn't horrible but it's still radiation and this is where they live so there's also that whoa that's almost scary I don't like that turn that off Ariadna, my life's work. Still a prototype, but it will recreate any event from the past. Whoa. If you feed it the right data. <laughs> Glad I didn't let those Brits destroy it. It will help me find Tatiana. Just like in the myth of Tessius. Web of lies. Ariadna's thread will lead me to the truth. Hopefully. Sufficient data. Select. I have a question. What's up? Me do a manual save. Cool. Try playing bless, but all the names are invalid slash taken. Really? That happened to you? No. <laughs> That's interesting. Guess we just have to sleep. End the day and go to sleep. Just my luck. That sucks. Yeah, it's weird. I mean, some were taken, but none of mine were. Oh God. You need to understand. It wasn't my decision to shut dreaming. down Ariadna. I don't blame you, Grace, but I still think it's a mistake. It's so much more than Pandora. It allows us to step into the realm of human memories and thoughts. Into the real world. What can I tell you, Eagle? I really the type decided in it wasn't financially gibberish. viable. It was too outlandish. 3.30. Ah, the fools! Every object is a natural dosimeter. Everything absorbs radioactive particles throughout That's its me. life. Thus creating an echo in time and space. Ariadna can recreate this echo in a fractal VR simulation. Super cool. There's nothing outlandish about it. Look, I get it. I do. It's your life's work. But just so think about it's it. actually not the end of the world. It's just the it's just Chernobyl. So it's alternative of events of Chernobyl or like it's people living inside. I don't think it's the end of the world actually. Batteries that use the graphite from recycled radioactive waste. That's just another project right now, Igor. I still don't think it would be enough for Ariadna to work. You need a power source that doesn't exist yet. Perhaps oh, that's the that thing that we just picked Earth. up. But... I'm sorry, Igor. It's over. You need to accept it and move on. The Ardriana? That's the, uh, the thing that we have in that room. Yeah, right here. Fuck the board. I'm <laughs> not going to let anyone destroy my work. Wake up. Wake up, Igor. Tanya? Is this a dream? I'm waiting for you, my love. Find me. Hurry. I don't have much time left. I'm trying, Tanya. I really am. I need to look at my board. See, there's that thing. The first clue. When I find more, I can feed the data to Ariadna and see what really happened to Tanya. Ah. I see. So, like, this, these things will lead to that. And then these will lead to this. And then that will lead to those two. Note to self. Focus on finding more clues. <laughs> Note to the player. Find more clues. Basically. <laughs> And find more people. I can't wait I to see how there, little mouse. this place builds up. Who is this? A better question is, who, who are, are you? you? What? What? <laughs> I kid, Mousy. I kid. I know where you are, and I know who you are looking for. Yes. Let this be enough for now. 
Listen, I have something to show you. Something very important. Oh, but we must meet in person. Oh, this is not something to explain. It must be seen. I don't know who you are, but I'm not walking blindly into some trap. Blind? Oh, goodness, no, on the contrary. I wish for you to see. Meet me at the Duga Radar Command Center. You know it, yes. Duga Radar? Who the hell is this? Oh, this is insane. Okay. I heard. What are you going to do? Go meet our mystery man, I guess. The real mystery is why that guy isn't strapped to a bed someplace, huh. juiced up on Haldol. Reminds me of a punch back from Mad Max I game. have to take the risk. I remember that. Sure. That was he might so know long ago. Or he might just be waiting to split your skull open with a hatchet and eat your liver. I really don't think this is a good idea. It sounds exactly like a trap. Mind him, Tatiana is the priority. Reassure Oliver. Yeah, it sounds like a trap, but we can't afford to ignore him. Anyway, I've got the gun. I'll be extra careful. You better be. I don't want to find your head on a spike somewhere out in the marshes. Regardless of how I feel about Tarakan, he could be my only chance of finding Tatiana. I love Set how it actually has RPG choices. Towards your own death. Like and different avenues that you can take. Knows our location. Him and his nutty buddies could be closing in on us right now. We have a good defensive position here. We should sit tight and defend it, if it comes to that. I appreciate the tactical input, Olivier, but I have to do this. Okay. You can literally go on a heist. Team members gathered one out of five. Oh. That's the, um... I see. Anton. That actually looks like um the guy from Metro. Sign missions. The weather in Chernobyl can change changes every day. The weather can mute the noises you're making and fog obscures the lines of the view of your opponents. This can be used to your advantage. Monitor monitor the exclusion zone and adjust your equipment to the situation before you go on a mission huh. that's pretty cool well he has a 100% for resting in the base <laughs> a memento for the past I've, I've been contacted by a strange man who seems to know more than he should he wants to meet in person can still visit in search of resources and food. Oh, okay, so these are just different areas to go to, to explore and things like that. That's cool. Huh. Um, I feel like I should have him go get some food. 58% or actually let's do the medicine. So we'll assign him to get medicine. And I will assign myself to go here. And then go ahead and start mission. And yes. Yeah, there's a good amount of places that Duga, you can actually go to. A, a huge frightening monstrosity made of steel. The epitome of the Cold War and insatiable ambition. But what does it have to do with you or me? It's been so many years, but someone must remember Igor. Someone has to know. Day two, the Moscow Eye afternoon. Nice. All right, let's see. Got a bunch of stuff here. One right there. Ah, oh, there's actually a good amount. Which one's our main objective? Think this one? Yeah, memento from the past. 
Okay. Flashbacks give me Death Stranding vibes. I can see that. All right, let's do the loot. Give me the loot. Give me the loot. Give me the loot. You okay? What the hell? It doesn't look good. How did this happen? Those things attacked us. The last one got to me. I blew its face off. And now I'm stuck here. By the way, can you spare a bullet? You want to kill yourself? I'm not stupid. I know I'm not getting out of this. At least... Let me end it. Before another one of those things shows up. Or kill me. At least you're a human. Give him a bullet. Attempt to free him. Wait. There must be some way to get you out of this. You're free to look for one. Just... Don't leave me hanging, huh? Yeah, there might actually be a way. I just don't know how, but hey, there might be a way. Jeez. Ah, oh, Chernobylite. No way. There you go. Would you look at that? Well, I'll be damned. I was sure I was a goner. Huh. <sighs> Thank huh. you. Maybe be more careful from now on. Hmm? I will. Listen, I'll, I'll remember your face. Uh, hopefully I can return the favor one day. Well, I'll be damned. I was sure I was... Maybe be more... I will. Okay, let's hope so. Should be like, hey man, you should just come with us. Like, just come stay at our base. Help us. And I, I don't know. Uh, okay. Go to the next one. Oh, there's one right here. So, Tatiana Amalieva. Tens desire will probably be later down the road. Exactly. Hopefully. There's a thing over there. Take you, Igor Kimunik, as my wedded husband. And I promise you love, honor, and respect. To be faithful to you and not to forsake you. Until death do us part. Oof. Two, two skill points available. Talk to companions at the base for exchanging points. Oh god. Oh god. ASMR. Wait, I literally didn't see this guy. Oh, there he is. Is there a way of spotting them? I'm gonna hide back here. So, uh, Dev, hopefully in the next, like, two months or so, I'll have a nice stream room. And we'll be able to bring everything else back, too.
Not just the stream room, too. Oh, God. I'm trying to do this stealthily if I can. Yep, a little backyard for Kiara, too. And a garage for me. Dude, it's like perfect. It's four bedrooms. Way more than we actually need. And the, the home is like completely teched out and stuff too. So we're really, really looking forward to it. Are we becoming the Florida man? Nah, not yet. Unfortunately. That's probably years what out. The quartermaster made for dinner tonight? Hope it's not more fish. <laughs> well, you won't be having dinner tonight. So, you know what's actually kind of funny about this game? The more you kill, the more your condition and psych goes down. So you actually have to, like... Um... It restores health. I'm trying to see what we have to... Ever stores that shotgun ammo, rifle ammo. But yeah, no, no Florida just yet. Not for a, a while, but for what we got, I mean, we're pretty excited, happy. It looks really nice. We saw it. We fell in love with it. We made an offer on it, they accepted it, and now we're just in the process of hopefully actually getting it. As long as everything works out, we uh, will finally have it put together. Why am I naked? <laughs> yeah, what's going on? Same here. Same here. Whoa. Sir? Who's there? Hello? Why are you loitering here? Easy. I'm just looking for some parts. What? Speak louder. <laughs> I'm looking for some parts. Stop yelling. It's not safe here. Yeah, you wouldn't know right Why now. Why isn't it safe? Maybe I am. What kind of question is that? NKVD, of course. NKVD? The secret Soviet police? These bastards came around here snooping. They arrested my sister in soon. law for being a cool. My throat sight feels she dry. She has two cows. Two Actually, fucking cows, I do have cows, some water, but I want like an actual the drink. NKVD doesn't exist anymore. You don't need to worry about them. Yes, 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 your is a piece of shit. His goons are persecuting everyone, even decorated war heroes like myself. Duh. Oh my. What? You've got to speak louder, lad. My hearing is not so good anymore after some Fritz threw a grenade into my bunker. <laughs> do, do you have anything to trade? Perhaps some parts? Why didn't you ask sooner? Of course I do. I'll trade you junk for some bullets. I need to arm myself in case the NKVD comes back. Uh, exchange ammo for scrap? Ammo for gear. I'd like gear. to exchange a bullet for some scrap. One bullet. Five chemicals. Uh, four rifle bullets now hold on to that oh I'm good on all of that did like you find gear. anything really valuable take a look son gas mask oh really for 10 rifle bullets um, 
We don't have a gas mask, so I'll take that. Sure. See you later. See you later. Thank you, sir. So how does this work? The gas mask? Do we just like put it on? Quick menu. Eat. Protection. Okay. So we'll wait until like we're in an area that's like very high in radiation, I guess. All of this is good here. That's cool. We actually met somebody. Now there's definitely an entrance down here somewhere. There's, there's stuff being lit up all over the place. I can't tell if there's a person. Okay, that's a guy. Hello, sir. Locksmith. What's Hello, up, bro? fellow prospector. I'm looking for someone. A tall, hunched man with long brown hair. Maybe you've seen him. No, I'm sorry. What's this all about? How would I know I'm what hair they my have? Brother, Athanasius. He vanished without a trace a while back. I've been looking everywhere. Metrovision? And what have you both been doing here anyway? The zone's a dangerous place. Well, don't expect me to reveal our trade secrets, but... Well, let's just say there are many unclaimed riches still here in Pripyat. Really? Division like Metro? <laughs> You've got a nice aura. I'll let you discover that for yourself. I've got a nice what? <sighs> Never mind. I'm looking for someone as well. I'll keep an eye out for your brother. Thank you, my good sir. May Lady Luck smile upon your prospecting. Okay. Safe travels, Good. my friend. Good oh, on trout. And take that. this. Perhaps it will come in handy. Huh. Thank you. A lockpick. Cool. What a nice guy. Um. Cool. Let's try going this way because our objective's over there, anyways. So. Might as well. Yeah, right? You would think that, like, in a world like this, the less people would be this friendly. <laughs> but no, it turns out a lot of people are very friendly, actually. Okay. Same. Stop right there. You're on Pripyat Bradfa term now. I'm what? Where? <laughs> Bradfa. Pripyat Bradfa. You must be new here, huh? A tourist? What's your name? I was living here before this funny guy was even born. Yeah. I'm a tourist. My name is Igor. But what's going on? Bradfa runs this place. That's what's going on. Pripyat Bradfa. And you will obey the rules, Igor the tourist. Uh, what is this? Bradfa? Bradfa is Sasha, Grisha, Oleg, Vova, and Aloysia. And Evgeny. Interesting. And where are all these guys? Let me think. Uh, Sasha got arrested. Grisha was shot. Uh, Oleg fell to his death. <laughs> Vova drowned, Aloysia overdosed, only Evgeny is left. And I take it that Evgeny is you? Evgeny is me. I'm the last man standing. I'm the Pripyat Brat for now. I made the rules, you got it, tourist? Yeah. Yeah, I think so. You make the rules. Good. I like you already. Just remember the number one rule. Don't fuck with us. Nobody fucks with Bratva, tourist or no. You know, you listen pretty well. 
I've decided to let you join our gang. <laughs> you can be my second in command. Oh, it's an honor. Thank you. Chat. You can help me, friend. I'm looking for a woman. Her name's Tatiana Amilieva. Tatiana? Ah, a beautiful name. She sounds like a beautiful woman. Tell me, you have some photos? Uh, uh no. No, I, I had one, but, uh... Ah, uh, too bad. I've never heard of her. She's your woman, right? <laughs> ah, love. I was in love once. Ksenia. Oh, what a woman she was. She promised to cut my balls off if I ever betrayed her. <laughs> <laughs> and did she? What a funny guy you are. <laughs> I already like you. Nah, she didn't. She dumped me. But she said I was too smart for her. Uh, so, uh, anything interesting going on around here lately? Well, there's something fishy happening in the power plant. Those NAR fuckers have been running around like crazy lately. And there's this creepy fuck with a black mask hunting for something. Whatever <gasps> it is, it's bad for business. He leaves me alone, but he scares my customers. So you do have other customers? What did I just say? That fucker's been scaring him away. If it wasn't for him, this place would be busier than the Ismolovsky market. You mentioned something about Trey. What kind of th I don't know. <laughs> what do you mean? Duh. I, I never opened them, so I don't know. That doesn't make any sense. Duh. <laughs> my loot boxes are like a box of chocolates. You never know what you're gonna get. <laughs> That's deep. I know. Ksenia told me I was the biggest facility here in our neighborhood. It's very simple. One food ration for one box of loot. One box a day. Igor, we just met, but I feel like I've known you for years. You're like a brother to me now. But don't tell anyone. It's a secret. A broad for secret. He gave me a free loot box. <laughs> you mentioned something about Trek. What kind Sorry. Okay, free one for today. Bradford forever. Interesting. Bradford forever. I love how he's just doing like the squat. You got something out of that conversation, exactly. We literally got something out of the conversation. So in the end, it was worth it. Damn. Their shadows are ingrained in the wall. How do we get back there? Imagine the box has 10 bullets. Hey, I wonder if we can open it. Like now. What was that? What if that guy's... Oh, wait, no. I think that's just the wall paint. <laughs> what is that? You can hear his music from all the way up here, too, which is funny. I think the green stuff is, like, the really, the really good stuff. Like the best loot you can usually find. Okay. Like the doors flash for a second. What the heck? Oh. That's creepy. I don't like that. The heck? Interesting. 
It's hard to see some of these doors. Oh, nice. We got Dorothy, a clue. Pripyat Cafe. Duga. What in God's name does it all mean? We'll have to try to go back down to the other one. What was that? Gas mask filter. Oh god, that drops down directly into some other stuff. There's a radio. One second. Cool. Uh, sketchy steps. <laughs> Let me save. Saves? It, it actually saves a lot, so it's good. A lot of electrical parts down here. Some mushrooms. Have you seen Half-Life Alex? Yeah, I actually, I played it for about a day. Um, and I actually streamed like the first two hours of it. Um, reason I stopped is because I bought it at $60 and I sat down and it was like, am I really going to get $60 out of this game? Although, yes, it was very good, um, for the little amount of time that I played it. I know that I'm not going to personally get 60 out of it. So I was like, you know, what? I actually refunded it until, uh, until I can, uh, get it at a cheaper price. And then also, um, not only that, but also, uh, play it in a better room. So like I, I've actually full on stopped playing VR games currently because I've been waiting for us to get a place. So that way I can actually set my stuff up to play VR games. Um, there's definitely a way to get up there. yeah vr games are it's so weird because like you would think that like vr games would actually be like a little bit cheaper because they're such like a uh special like niche for people right now but no it's actually expensive there are some definitely some great vr games out there though it's just having to pay that price Oh, okay. I see now. So you have to get a burner. VR is for non-gamers, in my opinion. Ah, oh, no. VR. I would say VR is is gamer thing. That's like me saying. Um. I mean, like I I see what you're saying, but it's a, it's like the same thing as like mobile gaming. As much as like some people want to say mobile gaming isn't real gaming, like technically it is. It's just a different form of gaming. Oh. Yeah. I get that. Yeah, let's try going in here. Pick lock. Wait, we have a lock pick. Unless if you have to actually equip it. Yar, don't cry. You got you.
Hold on, Kiara's crying. The uh, Marvel game comes out later this month, so I'm looking forward to that. Definitely. Where is the lockpick? I know we have one. We literally just got one. Haha, <laughs> Kiara. Food ration. Somebody gave us a lockpick. I know that. Oops. Takedowns are quieter and won't neg negatively affect Igor's psych. That's nice. Like 25% more damage to enemies. Cool. Look at all these skills. Once you have certain people, companions, you can get skills from them, which is pretty neat. Like, we've been here for not even that long, and we've already met a few people. Well, yeah, I mean, we could go directly over to the objective and just walk right out of here. But I'm also kind of, like, chilling right now. I'm just trying to figure out where's the lockpicks. The guy literally gave me one. Is there a companion skill that you need to be able to do it? Reflex. Discipline. Camouflage. Capacity. Health bars increased. And cheaper. Like, I know that guy gave us one. Where is it? Oliver. Ammo, ammo, ammo. Medicine. Chemicals. Chemical parts, herbs. Food ration, metal plate. Healing. He literally gave us a lockpick. Craftable tools. S mask filter allows you to previously. It allows you to change previously created modifications for any weapon. he gave us one bothering me because there's so much stuff in there like look right there a crafting station a, a locksmith do you have any more maybe he has more i don't know if i used it anywhere maybe unless if i used it somewhere hello fellow prospector hey bro do you have any uh Let's see what you've got, pal. Herbs, mushrooms, how about gear? One lock pick for two food rations. Okay. Safe travels, my friend. Thank you, friend. Here we go. Oh, so you don't even have to do anything when you lockpick it. You just have to open it. Ah, there we go. So much better. Yes. Thank you. Whoa. And there's a field station, too. Magazine. Trigger system. There's even different types of magazines you can make. That's crazy. Wow, barely uses any. Huh. 
That's awesome. Two, four, and two? Yeah. Wow. Holy range. Yeah, I'll take that. Wondering if we could do more, should do more stability stuff. About to modify this entire thing. There we go. Boom. Equipped out. Cool. Uh, now let's go into our inventory. Let's swap this to number one. Make our pistol number two. Uh, and then we'll make this thing number three. And this can be number seven. We're leaving. Surprised you can do this much early on. True. Here we go. I'm sure like difficulty wise though, if I up the difficulty, we would probably find a lot less stuff. So that probably like pushes it up in a way. Um, I'm actually going to go this way. One thirty meters away. Oh. Uh, where's my, which one is eight? Are you good, bro? Time to finish the job, you bastard! What the hell happened here? God, use your eyes, genius! God, goddamn creature from hell got the drop on us! Here. Yeah. This should get you back on your feet. Thank you. I won't forget this. Wow, look at us being the nice guy. Is there another one of those things? For us to grab? I'll see one. Let me make a crafting station real quick. I gotta make calming salts. Psych, yeah. Craft. Make like three of these. Jeez, what the heck, Kiara? That was out of nowhere. Scrap that. Um, do we have them? Number, uh, what is it? six? There we go. Much better. Gives you three back.
Probably more fucking mice. Better check anyways. Sorry, dude. Cue the sad music. Something's in here. Oh God. Is that? Oh, that's a gun. We didn't pick up his gun. Rifle ammo. Okay, I think that's really all the uh, objectives here. <laughs> Except for the main one. So. Let's head back over there. We've got like tons of supplies and other stuff now. Um. And we saw everybody we could meet so far, so. Okay, so F5 is safe. Nice. If I remember correctly, there was a guy around here. Yeah, there's a few guys here, actually. Like nervous somebody's gonna come out anywhere. This is the same music box I gave to Chana for her birthday. What's this? There's something clipped to the inside. Why did is you come here? So Tatiana was under KGB surveillance. Why? Oh. What did they want with her? They didn't want her. Wanted me. Probably. Recognize it? You wanted to talk. Let's talk. Not with me. The old fella wanted you to see this first. You're running out of time. How did you get it? Not here. Meet me in the building next door in a couple of minutes. This just keeps getting better and better. Oh, shh. Radiation. That was pretty bad. Uh, four. Four. He wants me to meet him up there. Saw this somewhere. How do we get in there? 
save. Can we just like sprint for it? You almost had it. Go again. Oh, I pumped off the edge. Wait, what if he's on the other side? It says he's like right here. Okay. Um. Really? Maybe I'm doing something wrong. I'm like right there, right there. It's literally right there. Come on. Jump to that thing. Like, it looks like you could get here. That's your health. Uh, I wonder if the red is just ra radiation use. Ah, uh, yeah, that's what it is. That's why I wouldn't let me use it earlier. Damn it. How do I get up there? I really don't know. Like, it looks like you could, like, casually walk right there. Go up to the side. What? What mission am I on? I'm really about to look it up.
Okay. All right, I think I'm going the wrong way. <laughs> I think he's upstairs. <laughs> oh, I do. Are you serious? What took you so long? Oh my Did the god. Tiny dancer get your attention? I was going the wrong way. He said it would. He's gonna <laughs> test you before he decides if he likes you. Every fucking thing is a test with that crumbling fruitcake. But at least he pays well. <sighs> Are you going to explain to me what this is all about? Captain Spastic said you'd recognize a big fucking radar assembly and that it means something to you. Then he mumbled something about the Rat King and the end of the world, but I don't think he was serious about that part. I came here to talk to the old man, not his errand boy. I'm going back. The fuck you say? You're a lucky son of a bitch. I'd mess you up, but then I wouldn't get paid. Now shut your fucking face and pay attention when your betters are talking. You've got a choice to make. It's easy. You can either use the detonator to blow this metal monstrosity to kingdom come, or you can use the other thingy to upgrade your PDA. That will improve the functionality of every scanner in the network. Why do I have to choose? Don't know. Don't care. I did my fucking job. Now you do yours. And who the hell are you supposed to be? I'm a man on a job, that's all. Yeah? That's all you need to know, friendo. Last piece of advice. This guy is crazy loco, sure. But there's always some kind of reason behind what he's doing. So, ask yourself, why would he want you to make this choice? Do the PDA upgrade. So, what does it do? Improved scanning area. You have three skill points available now. Nice. That wasn't that guy's brother, was it? What's this? Oh, we already got that clue. Okay. Uh, let's go back down, I guess. At some point, we'll need that Chernobylite burner or something like that. Go back to this guy. <laughs> That's so funny. Hello, fellow prospector. Chat. And what have you both been doing here anyway? Well, don't ex well, let's just really you've got an got a nice thank you. Safe okay. travels, my friend. All right, let's get back to base. So that was seven, I think. Yep. Oops. Yeah, I guess. Mission success, a memento from the past. Nice. The, his mission was a success. Good. Normal food. Yep. Beautiful. Chat with him, Igor, The gun I gave you has traveled all around the world with me, but it's quite old. What do you think about building a calibration tool to upgrade it? Sure. Sounds good. I'll fabricate one when I get the chance. You need it, Igor. Okay. 
he wants me to make that um Tori gardening Air quality goes down. But we have enough parts to build all this. Metal. Double light. Okay. Let's do Weaponsmith, Armor Smith, Containers, Gardening. Laboratory, first aid kit. Uh, gas mask will fill that. Scrap any. Huh. Whoa, radiation chamber G. Okay. Uh, revolver ammo. Shotgun shell and rifle ammo. Revolver calibration tools. Here we go. Put this like right here. Boom. I'm proud of you, Igor. Craft. Whoa, that's so cool. So many different options. Up to nine bullets, up to 14 rounds. Jeez. Did a nine bullets. Range and stability, recoil reduction. We'll do this one. Range and recoil reduction. Need more mushrooms, apparently. <laughs> hey, let's do this one. Some parts we have plenty of, other ones we do not. Okay, I think we need a, uh, generator, power supply. Put this down here. Large laser cunning machine. Comfort, life and base. Power excess. We got plenty of power now. Crazy how there's like multiple things you can make too. I already have one of this type. This one right here. Cheat metal tools, primitive armor, camouflage, tactical armor, heavy. 
the next one you need like uh let's see containers eh. most popular every day one upon or they would add a small amount of herbs to the oh okay yeah that's actually pretty good uh you need six though Ooh. yeah we have plenty of chemicals but we need the herbs to be able to make them that's the problem uh same thing with that we're at the point where we need herbs and mushrooms now for anything else okay that's fine ah here we go craft nice actually have an ak now oh okay i see do we have a weapon upgrade station because we just crafted two weapons but oh i wonder if when we get more people if like we'll have to give them weapons rifle ammo okay let me see if i can move this actually pick up move it back just a tiny bit please And then let me actually pick up this. Place. Up. Place. Yeah, that's good for now. I mean, we can always move stuff down the line i'm proud of you igor thank you train oh that place your base isn't comfortable makes your companion twitchy do you think you could find some time to teach me some of your military tricks <laughs> no there are no tricks or shortcuts when it comes to improving your survival skills or shooting but i'll be happy to teach you some basics It'll make my job easier, too, if you know how to handle yourself out there. Okay. Precision, stealth, or stunning. Revolver. Clicks that. Move, run, and jump more quietly. Fire. Yeah, definitely. Perfect. That one. Let's do it. Follow me. Follow me. I would actually... Wow. You actually go out and get trained. Taking out your enemy requires huh. guts. Taking out your enemy quietly is an art. I think you've got what it takes to do the former, but you suck mightily at the latter. Now, the lesson is about knocking out your opponent without being spotted by him or anyone else. The secret lies in understanding human anatomy as well as stealth. It's about knowing how to apply enough force to put your opponent out of commission without killing them. Let's put theory into practice. Sneak up on me and uh, perform that's a choke why. Don't worry about hurting me. I'm a professional. That's why it won't um, anger him or like make him go Let's crazy begin. because they'll be able to actually uh, sneak up and knock him out. That helps your uh, psych a lot. Okay, Igor, enough. That was impressive. Well done, soldier. You Thanks. did great, Igor. But remember, there's no such thing as too much practice. Okay. What's going on, Igor? Can I train again? Do you think you could find some... <laughs> but I'll be... Uh, do I have enough for... No, I don't have enough for stealth. That's fine. Maybe some other time. You're the boss, Igor. Remove them from the team. Can we use sure? But oh, they actually give them weapons and stuff. Current armor. Oh, 
file or oh so this uses metal plates for you huh that's cool we need to give him ammo too what's going on igor can Show we use again? sure Um, well, let me see if I can get comforting things. Oh, you can. Memory catalyst. Play with your memory in state of the art prototype virtual reality. Here's your chance. Whoa. Gramophone. <laughs> or Russian rap. We can make one of those. We're out of chemicals. Plus 20. Whoa. Chernobylite throne. What? That's so cool. Why did it have so many cool things, actually? A wooden wall? Whoops. doll creepy doll nothing to see here move along barrel somebody can sit on it catch a breath and feel a little bit better it actually helps more than like other items bin put some bins Oh, lights actually help the comfort. Wow. Wow. They're so cheap to make, too. It only costs one point each. Actually, we can put it right there. Beautiful. We actually got some light in this place. And it's more cozy now. Cool. Yes, end the day. Day three, the refuge. Inspect. Piat Cafe. Huh. All right, chat. Hold on for just a second. Um, I'm gonna run to the bathroom and do some uh, do something else real quick, and then we shall continue. Reach the maximum. All right, I will be. All right, chat. I'm back. All right, let's go ahead and uh, continue here and see how much further we Anybody can. Anybody there? Yet. Hey, answer the radio for once, you cocksuckers! This is fucking important. Come on, don't leave me standing here with my dick in my hand. Who is oh. this? Who is this? Are you retarded? It's your fucking landlord, scrote. By the way, how are you enjoying your stay, Mr. Kimenyuk? Mikhail. I'm in the middle of something. Glad you like the place. I hope you leave it in the same pristine condition you found it. You got a real bargain, you know. But now we need to talk business. Anton and Olivier around? Anton is... He was killed. Oh, my. Uh, what a pity. Yeah, he was such a nice guy. Yeah, perhaps too fucking nice. Yep, I'd bet my last cigarette that's what got him killed. 
I don't think so. What do you want, Mikhail? I need you to return the favor and help me wipe the NAR database. And before you start bitching about it, I know you're not that kind of scientist. I'll walk you through the whole thing. Uh... I sure. should use any opportunity I get to hurt NAR. Okay, I'll do it. That's my brave lad. Head to the building in the Duca complex. I'll be in touch. All right. Well, we got a plan. I overheard your conversation with Mikhail. Don't tell me you're actually Mikhail. going. Mikhail. Mikhail is a bit off. Mikhail. But he's not wrong about crippling NAR. It could buy us some time. He sounds like a sociopath. Do you trust him? No. But that doesn't mean I'm not going to deal with him. We only need him because of this warehouse. Right now, he looks more like a liability than an asset. On the other hand, you might discover something important. I don't know. Nah, it's too risky. You should ignore him. I think I'm going to go along on this one thing and see how it goes. I strongly advise against that. I know his type. He probably eats his Wheaties with cocaine in the morning. <laughs> Thank you for those wise words of wisdom. Let's table this discussion for now. All right. Sign missions. The exclusion, uh, exclusion zone changes under influences of your decisions and the progress you're making. If you can see, if you can see more helicopters in the sky and more NAR patrols in the fields, prepare better for combat. You are bound to meet more soldiers with better equipment during your mission. If you can see more Chernobylite around the power plant and chances of encountering more and stronger monsters increases. Passage of time also affects the ex exclusion zone. It becomes more and more radioactive and the increasing amount of Chernobylite particles in the air increases the frequency of Chernobylite storms. Build special machines in the zone to counter counteract these forces of nature or even completely reverse them. Got it. So. That's saying... Where's that area that the, I can see that thing flying around. I'll go to Moscow Eye. That's me. Medicine drop, food supply. Food drop. One has the highest amount. Do this one, 80%. Start mission. Let's -a go! Do you really trust Mikhail? Perhaps you just want to follow the crazy Damn. and see how deep the rabbit hole goes. Mikhail. Once you cross that bridge, there's no turning back. The NAR will have you in their crosshairs. Here we go. Then an enemy. Oh. Or not. Why are you barking?
We need more lock picks. Run into so many of them. I don't think we can make any, right? Crafting tools. Yeah. Space. In these, yeah. Radiation safety. Stop radiation particles slows down the rate of radiation growth in the zone. But it also increases radiation safety or decreases the safety. Delays storms, and then this one does that. Reminds me of uh, Metro. Yeah, pretty much. That's what a lot of people said. I feel like Metro, like in itself has like its own genre of games now <laughs> kind of like there's so many games like uh metro stalker style but like i think that's pretty cool What is she doing? I'm wondering if there's a piece that we can grab right here that will stop this. Sometimes there is. Right now, I'm just doing some good old exploration. Just... Where's she then? I love like all the people that you actually meet though. I think that's so cool. When you scanned it, it was going to scan it for everybody now. Go to sleep. Oh no. Take out the urine. Who else? I think our sanity is okay after that. Didn't go down horribly, so. Uh, it says there's something up here. What the? I should just walk away from that. Oh God. I don't like that. I'm just gonna walk away. What the hell? They can keep watching that. I am not gonna bother them. Why do I hear things? Oh, hell no, dude.
Yeah, I ain't bothering some dolls watching some TV. <laughs> Why is it getting darker? All right, maybe I should bother them. Oh, f no, dude. No, 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 no. Oh, God. <laughs> I don't want to unpause. I'm taking my headphones off <laughs> and doing this. Oh, my God. There's a head left. Oh, hell no. <laughs> Why did I think that was a good idea? I got skill points from it, though. So I guess in that aspect, it was worth it. Wait, is this the same place I was at before? It is. There's just new things here. Why? Yeah. Go down. Oh God. Do you have you okay? graves to find girls to fall in love with, Igor? Do you have to open graves to find girls to fall in love with, Igor? Heed the call from the void. Heed the call from the void. Repeat the words coming from my dead lips. Repeat the words coming from my dead lips. And Marana Domus Nava Cronatus. And Marana Dominos Nava Cranatus. Crudux Cruo. Crudux Cruo. Stop grasping what cannot be grasped. Stop grasping what cannot be grasped. Forget about her. Forget about her. Dig deeper, and pain is all you're going to find. Dig deeper, and pain is all you're going to find. That which is not dead. That which can eternally lie. And with strange eons, even love may die. That which is not dead. That which Once can eternally lie. lie and with strange himself. eons, even love may I'm die. Call on it. Do you have open graves to find girls to fall in love with, Igor? Do you have to open graves to find girls to fall in love with, Igor? Heed the call. From the void. All right, I'm done. Heed the call from the void. I knew it. No. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. Give me the loot. <laughs> Is he asleep? Are you good? Is really passed out. I go to this last one. And these are actually kind of funny when they show up. The heck? Hey, come out, whoever you are. Oh, no, we got a man down. 
Did I save him? Thank you, kindly citizen. I can tell you're a good man. Not like those vandals. I just need to catch my breath. Uh, shouldn't we be running from the monster? What? <laughs> Don't worry. That was just a ruse to get past these brutes. Really? <laughs> it almost cost you your life. Audendum est fortis adiubat ipsa venus. I missed it because I ran up too fast. What does it mean? It means you should have paid more attention in school, citizen. Now go before a real monster shows up. Okay. Oh. I'm gonna walk away and hear him scream. I thought this thing was supposed to scan enemies. I guess not. Is that? Because you forgot to top off the radiator with water, dumbass. That's where the fucking engine overheated. Come again? No, fuck you. You're the one who's supposed to top it off. That's your job. It's your fucking fault. Oh, really? You're such a good driver, are you, huh? God. Then for fuck's sake, drive here and pick me up. Okay. This, there's a lot of uh, industrial materials at this one. I feel like there's other places, probably like the forest and stuff that we're at that has like a lot more herbs and all that. Um, we can try doing this one too. Oh wait, that? Yeah, that's this guy. This guy gives free stuff. He's in a new area. Oh, I didn't know that. Right there, you're on Rippy and Brad for turf now. Me, bro. So, well, there's something fishy happening in the power plant. Those NAR fuckers have been running around like crazy, and there's this creepy fuck with a black man. He leaves me alone. So you do have. What did I just say? You mentioned something about what kind of thing. What about this? That'll be one. Sure. Sure thing. There you go. It's just Thanks. Thanks for the loot box. I better be going now. Brad for forever, Eagle. Inventory is full. Oh no. Actually full. Um How do we make more space? Oh wait. do with the I forgot that I have an AK actually um dude I don't know what to do I mean I can probably just drop some of this stuff and then just pick it up after I open this yeah Where'd the rest of my stuff go? There we go. Cool. That's good there. Who is this? That's the guy that we met earlier. Okay. Go inside here.
another lockpick needed. What do I have to do? Hello? Ah, that makes sense. Alrighty then. First up, every mission needs a code name that is totally unrelated to the job itself. Any ideas? I don't care. I don't care. It's weird, but it's not going to work for our purposes. How about Panzerkampfwagen? Hey, you like it, right? <laughs> Good. Anyway, I tracked down the comms vehicle that does the rounds every week. There's a laptop inside that you need to get at. And? And upload an exploit that'll get you inside. Fine. Look sharp. The truck is coming. Commence Operation Panzer Kampfwagen. The f Oh, whoops. My mission? Whoops. Alright, chat. Give me like two seconds. I need to grab something real quick. Hey, chat. Let's see if we can finish up this mission here. And here we go. So let's do six. And four. Mikhail, I've got the laptop. Tell me what to do. Great fucking job. Type in www.hardisalonelyhunter.ru and press enter. Download the last file in the column, the one called Sweet Lonely Boy Will Meet Sugar Mom. Cool name, yeah? Execute the file, and voila, you got access to their database. Uh, unless you screwed something up. Next step is to get to the comms tower and strike the fatal blow. Hey, Igor, before you rush off, look for some intel first. You want to find Tatiana, remember? Olivier is right. There must be something in the NAR database about Tatiana. Fuck, no, you can't do that! If you start digging around, they'll lock you out, and we'll lose our shot at kicking them in the digital nuts! Remember, you still need to get to the comms tower and upload the actual virus! Can you provide some kind of distraction? Perhaps a fucking lootly! In fact, I've been waiting for you to ask. Okay. So now we run back over there, I guess. This guy's just chilling right here. <laughs> okay. Is this what you 
did you guys do for work when you come back from Syria? Contact. Second floor. Don't let him get away. Oh, God. Did he just blow himself up? God damn it! Mikhail! Mikhail! Wait, no, there's a guy on the second floor. <laughs> I'm fine! Yeah, but, uh, don't come near the building. I think the charges were too close to the chemicals up. What do you think is in those barrels? Fuck! Maybe you should call Gazprom's emergency line. <laughs> just get the hell out of there! Ah, don't worry about me. Just wipe the servers. Go to www.hardisalonelyhunter.ru, download Smelly Panties of Doom, and execute. I wish you could search the data, but you only get to enter a single command before it boots you out, so no typos. Fuck this maniac, Igor. Query the database while you've got the chance. It's done. I hope it hurts. Got it. Hack into the NAR servers. Level three, and we have multiple new uh, skill points available. Wait. Oh, uh, so you can put it on and then take it off. I see. Which one is our way out of here? Seven. All right, let's get out of here. I guess that's it. Still just us. All right, chat. I think right here. Right here is just about a perfect spot to stop for tonight. Uh, tomorrow we will pick up where we're currently at and continue. Looks like the area is getting a little bit more populated now. We're seeing more helicopters and things like that. Um, so yeah, should be fun though. Uh, we'll go down to, to Igor tomorrow and everything else. Hopefully start recruiting some people. Uh, it's been a good startup so far. Three and a half hours, uh, pretty fun but i'm looking forward to to playing some more i uh, again thank you to the to the devs and key mailer for a copy of this game uh so far i really enjoy it so i think playing more is uh going to be a good time and everything so yeah uh, youtube twitch facebook discord twitter that's where i'll be at in the meantime though